Good day, good day! How the fuck are ya? This is your friend Dan O, and this is Roverland, the YouTube channel that's anything and everything Land Rover. Have I got a video for you today? All right, all right, all right. Welcome to a one up Wednesday. We got an uh, interesting uh, one up Wednesday for you. Yeah, so. Uh, Make sure you give me a big thumbs up. Uh, make sure you're subscribing, share with your friends. Come on over to Facebook, leave a comment, a picture, whatever you can. Uh, make sure you leave a comment down here, all right? Well, this is it, your friend Dano. I've got a one on Wednesday, and today we're going to be talking about this one right here. New for 2021. That was just last year, if you didn't remember. <laughs> this uh, is being filmed in 2022, but no no big thing. All right, so this was the first year that uh, the Range Rover Classic was released by Hot Wheels. Pretty awesome. Here's the back of the card. Yes, the car for all seasons. I love it. I love it. Uh, so this is what they uh, came out as. Uh, let's take a look. I got the rack up here and just a beautiful car two-door Range Rover uh, These wheels are huge compared to what they really would have on them, but that's the American way uh, Yes, very very nice red black base simple base really uh, black base Range Rover Classic. This has uh, got that. They all came with this wheel, and I, I'm sorry, I don't know what Hot Wheels calls that, but black wheels, uh, tinted windows, tinted windows. There's back black back window with the wiper. Very cool. The Range Rover Classic on the license plate. Range Rover on the tailgate. Yes, very, very awesome, very awesome. So that came out in 2021 as the first edition. So that was pretty darn cool. Uh, later that year, they came out with this one here. This is a Kroger exclusive. And uh, Kroger is a grocery store. Um, I think they sell a couple of other different things, but they're a big uh, grocery store Midwest and, and beyond and um, all the cars I don't know how many there were I don't collect those but uh, this one came out in a white which was the counterpart to the red and we have one of those loose we'll just turn it around same oh it is different it is different yeah so I was gonna say backing but it's not it's it's different so these were a little bit harder to get a hold of um, and uh, white instead of red blue instead of black and uh, still quite nice got the Range Rover classic on the license plate rear uh, tailgate has the Range Rover front end now this is a little bit interesting oh I forgot to mention the interior on this one was black sorry about that trying to get all the the details here so this is white with blue with a red interior yes and a black base again and then the same wheels um, instead of being gray like the first one they're white but pretty much the same basic thing other than um, different paint schemes. All right, so then uh, came out this year, uh, 2021, which was 2022, came out this one here, a teal one. This one just came out not too long ago and uh, very, very cool. Let's take a look at the loose one there. Uh, they list this as a teal color black interior let's take a look at the back again now this is in the mud studs uh, um, uh, classification I, I, what do they call that series mud stud series that's what we'd want to call it and uh, different backing on that one of course but just a really cool now this has got a brown base to it versus the black base uh, black interior again and then the interesting and then the uh, smoke 
uh, windshield. They all had the smoke windshield. So mud studs in the license plate Range Rover on the tailgate. And then the interesting part about these is, is they have uh, mud molded tires. So obviously you can see that the uh, brown base versus the black base of the first two is different than this mud clay color. And they are uh marbled i don't know if we really can see that you can see some of the marbling there uh with the gro uh, chrome on the wheels uh interesting uh thing about this is um i found some uh variations in the wheels and i'm hoping that uh, my camera can pick this up uh so this is uh kind of the standard there is this uh but this one seems to be a little bit lighter than the regulars. And I'm not opening these up because these are kind of different. See, you can tell that these are much lighter. And so then now we're going to take a look at this one here, which had a light one and a dark one uh, paired with it. Yeah, kind of cool there. Different kind of variation, I guess. And then uh, this is uh, more of a dark dark. This is even darker than um, the other one. And I, I don't really know if, uh, you know, Hot Wheels would really say that they're wheel errors or anything like that. It's just kind of cool. When, once you get a few of these together, um, you know, you can really see. But these, um, from the selection that I have, and what do I have? uh 10 10 11 of them and uh these here uh, you can tell are different tires so just kind of cool these will be in the collection forever not for sale per se <laughs> but uh really kind of cool so there is the uh the latest and greatest well wait a minute <laughs> so late this year and 2022 we came with this one here Yes, so this is uh, Expedition, a totally different uh, paint scheme and uh, graphics from the uh, first two. So now we have two of the original and two of now this Expedition. So let's just take a look here. And uh, I don't have, oh yeah, I guess I do have quite a few of these. Uh, I guess I got seven of these. Yeah, so we are going to be able to open one. So let's turn it around here. Same kind of thing. Now these are also, again, in the mud series. So let's get this one open because I don't have one for the display. And I'd like to at least have one, you know, on uh, loose and then collect, you know, all the cards that I can. But I at least like to get uh, a loose one. And so what I did there off camera there. Uh, so I can get my razor blade. I just go right along the base there and cut that off so I can just open it right up and slide it right out. Look at there. All right. Well, let's take a look at this one for a one of Wednesday. This is the Range Rover Classic from Hot Wheels. The last two years have produced four copies. Very, very nice. So I, I really like this um, this tan color. I'm a tan khaki brown light brown <laughs> kind of guy and this is just awesome so once again we they call this a tan expedition uh series decals uh mud studs on the rear license plate range rover across the rear tailgate no decals or anything on the top uh so you know kind of saving Hot Wheels some money there. Uh, once again, tint windshield. This one has the black interior, which would be the grill, and then uh, black uh, base. So this this one is really the odd man out with a brown base. Uh, so pretty cool. And then now this has got uh, just tan brown tires. Brown tires, there's no marbling or anything to like that and it's kind of easier maybe to see when we put it against you know the other ones that are marbled a little bit um 
I don't know, the camera doesn't really pick that up so well. But uh, brown with the chrome on just the lip, not on the um, the, the five-spoke. Uh, so really kind of cool. There you go. Uh, leave a comment down below. Which one do you like best? The first original red, the Kroger exclusive, the teal one. I'm going to tell you right now, I'm too not too hot on teal. Uh, I think this one's my best, favoritist. Uh, I like the red, white, and blue. That is awesome. And you know the red, yeah. So this would be my first. I like the red, white, and blue. But yeah, this one is awesome. The graphics are great and everything. So all right, there you go. That's it for a one-up Wednesday, the Hot Wheels Range Rover Classic. All righty, folks. Uh, this is your friend Dano. Remember, you guys, Slow traffic, keep right, and have a great rover day!